After eight years of fine tuning its Android OS for all Android phone makers and six years of collaborating with others for its Nexus models, Google has come up with its own in-house smartphone. Google is calling them the first true Android phones because with the Pixels, it has full control over both the hardware and software. So basically, the Pixels are Google's own take of what an Android device should be like. But that is just one small reason why the Google Pixels are so appealing at the moment. Here are the five big reasons why you should get one of the Pixels. How are you doing guys? This is Biraj and you're watching MNS Tech & Toys. The first big reason to get the Pixel is it runs on the latest Android 7.1 Nugget, which comes with its own perks like Google's messaging service Allo and its video calling app Duo, Apple's 3D touch-like launcher shortcuts for apps, native night mode to reduce eye strain in the dark, GIF compatible Google keyboard, plus all the utilitarian features from Android 7. And one more thing, from now on, the Pixel is going to receive the software updates before any other Android device. The second big reason is the Pixel's fast, fluid-like performance. Both the Pixels come with 64-bit quad-core Qualcomm Snapdragon 821 processor. Speeding things up even more is a 4GB RAM in each of the Pixels. The tricky part is the internal storage. The Pixels either come in 32GB models or 128GB models. There are no 64GB Pixels. The battery department is more than satisfactory for their size. The smaller Pixel packs 2770 mAh and the Pixel XL packs 3450 mAh. But when used alongside Android's power-saving features, even power users should be able to get a full day's use. And when the juice runs out, the fast-charging USB Type-C will get the Pixel's non-removable battery from 0 up to 53% in 30 minutes. The third reason to get the Pixel is its cameras. Or should I say their killer photo quality and sharp 4K recording. The 12.3 megapixel f2.0 primary camera and the 8 megapixel f2.4 secondary camera on both the pixels slightly enhance the photos they take to make them a bit more vibrant and dynamic. The fourth reason is actually a bunch of pixel specific features that will not be available on other Android devices. The list starts with Google Assistant, which is universally integrated on the Android OS. Saying OK Google or simply long pressing the home button launches the Assistant screen and you can start making requests or asking questions in natural speech. The Assistant taps into Google's Knowledge Graph database and accesses 70 billion facts to find your answers to your questions or contextual information to your requests. Then there is the Pixel Launcher. It has an app tray that now docks 5 apps. Those apps can easily be turned into folders too. What's new is, there is no icon for app draw. You simply swipe up from the bottom to pull up the apps. Another Pixel specific feature is Google's Live Customer Care Service. That means Pixel users have 24-7 access to live support agents through phone, chat or screen share, which is a thoughtful and a great value addition to the Pixel phones. Talking about great value additions, Google is offering free unlimited cloud storage for all the pictures and videos taken with the Pixel phones. Then there is smart storage, which has eliminated the need for SD cards in the Pixels. Well, in a way, this new storage setting allows you to remove excess data from three categories. Photos, videos, downloads and apps. Photos and videos definitely eat more space on the phone, but you have the Pixels unlimited cloud storage to make their backup in full resolution. That takes me to the fifth reason, the fingerprint sensor on the back side of the Pixel. It's fast, has one of the fastest response times and is quite easy to access due to the ideal placement. But unlike the fingerprint sensors on other phones, the one in the Pixel does more than add a layer of security and unlock the device. It pulls down the notifications on the display when you slide down your finger on it. That may not sound all that significant right now, but it could very well hint that Google might be exploring and expanding what more these tiny fingerprint sensors can do. Those were the big 5 reasons why you ought to get one of these Pixels. The only reason why you should have second thoughts about buying one is that the Pixels are not water or shockproof for their price. Hopefully, that is all going to change in the new iteration. But even then, if you consider everything, the Google Pixel and the Pixel XL happen to be the best Android phones Google has ever created. Which is to say, they are the best Android phones ever created.
That's all for the show today guys. Thank you for watching MNS Tech and Toys. And if you have any queries or suggestions, do drop me a comment down below. You can also catch me on Kantibu TV. And don't forget to grab a print copy every Friday. Until next week, this is Biraj signing off.